Russian telegram channels are saying that a Russian unit was struck by HIMARS on the morning of the 14th of June, on the Kremina front, with more than 100 killed and 100 wounded soldiers. They were reportedly waiting near the front for a speech from a commander for hours. They blame the commander of Russia's 20th Combined Arms Army Major General Sukrab Akhmedov, who was previously blamed for the heavy losses from the 155th Brigade in Pavlivka in November. Grayzone says he and Muradov were promoted in February due to fabricated reports. One of the Lost Armor admins says it was a unit from the 144th Motorized Division. He says it was more likely from 155mm artillery, not HIMARS, and soldiers were unloading from trucks. The same unit previously took losses moving near the front in daylight. And we have more good news from Yalinske in Donetsk Oblast. Ukrainian forces hit a pair of Russian 2S-19 MSTAS self-propelled howitzers firing on the Velika Novosilka axis with another pair of GMRL's rockets, likely M30A1AW. And after the Birds of Magyar unit came to the Zaporozhye front, we have seen a destruction of a pair of Russian tanks in Staromayorsky. Epic video of a Ukrainian FPV kamikaze drone completely obliterating a Russian BMP. Another spectacular explosion of a Russian truck with ammunition after it stepped on remotely installed mine. Ukrainian soldiers are happy for the gifts from the temporary Russian Federation. The first blindfold battalion is forming. By the way, the sign on a cup says, a tooth for a tooth. According to Russian media, the Novocherkask State District power plant is on fire. The roof of the 6th power unit is reportedly on fire. Just another arson in Kazan, Russia. Russian military correspondent Sladkov confirmed he had to stay in quarantine before meeting Putin yesterday. We hope he didn't have lices. Alexander. These are reportedly shells provided by the Russian Federation to its fighters. Would you dare to use these?
the unique Ukrainian BTRT based on the tank T-64, which exists in perhaps only one copy, tows the Ukrainian BMP-2. An activist throws Russian rubles upon Georgian Dream MPs in Georgian parliament in protest of Georgia's growing alignment with Russia. The 110th separate mechanized brigade showing how Russian equipment is being targeted from the sky. Multiple pieces can be seen burning and or destroyed. Ukrainian army on the move. Ukrainian army. Thanks for watching, and don't forget to subscribe. Also, if you want to support Warthog Defense, please become our member and get early access to new videos, exclusive members only videos, and become administrator in comment section. The membership link is in the description. Rescues. Every day we had a guy last week at six rescues in six days. You know, he's doing the job every day.